MTD CNC, bringing you the latest engineering news via video media. Now, Lee, um, Starag, you've got the STC 800. Now, you guys are very, very strong in the blade technology market. Now, this is something a bit different for the casing market. That's right, Mark. It's, it's a, this machine is used for many markets, so aero structures, but particularly for today, we're focusing on casings. And what we've done is we've combined, combined some new technologies on this machine, so it's a fully five-axis simultaneous milling machine, but it's also got turning capability as well. And why does that make it differently? Well, it, it means you can produce a casing in a very small number of operations, two or three operations, and machine the inside and the outside of the component. So we have special heads that will get inside and do all the special features, and then we have standard operations for turning, milling, drilling, back spot facing, those, those kind of features. And I've noticed a very, very big tool changer at the back as well. Well, y y you can start with 60 or 80 tools, you can go up to 500 tools. That depends on how the customer wants to configure his machine. And what type of sectors from a UK perspective would this offer or this machine be aimed at? It's predominantly aerospace, but it's also power generation. So any cylindrical components with complex features that need to be turned and milled outside and inside, titaniums, nickel alloys, various materials. Could it be adapted for structures as well? It's also adapted for structures both in aluminium and titanium. And this particular machine has a 15,000 rev motor spindle with a HSK 100AT configuration, but we also do a number of gear spindles, high torque, for, for different materials. But the philosophy at Starag is very much build the actual machine around the job. Is that very true with this machine? Usually so. Customers will come to us with a problem and we'll develop a solution for them. But sometimes customers will come and they'll want a more general purpose uh, configuration so that they can put a number of different components on the machine. Lee, thanks very much. No problem, Mark. Thank you.